Number 10. Daredevil made his first appearance in Daredevil No. 1 which was published by Marvel Comics in April 1964. He was created by writer Stan Lee and artist Bill Everett, with input from Jack Kirby. Number 9. Over the years, Daredevil has undergone several costume changes, reflecting different storylines, artists, and creative directions. Here are some notable ones. Original Yellow Costume Daredevil's original costume was yellow with black accents. It featured a full head covering with no eye holes, emphasizing his other heightened senses. Classic Red Costume This is the iconic costume that Daredevil is most recognized for. It debuted in issue number 7 of his solo series and has undergone various modifications over time, but generally retains the red color scheme with a double D emblem on the chest. Armored Costume At times, Daredevil has worn an armored costume for added protection in particularly dangerous situations. This suit is bulkier and often has armored plating. Black Costume In certain storylines, Daredevil has adopted a black costume, typically to signify a darker period in his life or when he wants to operate more stealthily. Shadowland Costume During the Shadowland storyline, Daredevil became more of an anti-hero and donned a black costume with red accents. This suit was more aggressive in design reflecting his darker mindset at the time. Original Yellow Costume Return In some storylines, Daredevil has temporarily returned to his original yellow costume, either as a nostalgic nod or as part of a specific plot arc. Number 8. Daredevil, also known as Matt Murdock, possesses heightened senses as a result of being blinded by a radioactive substance as a child. His powers include Enhanced sense of hearing. Daredevil's hearing is extremely acute, allowing him to detect subtle sounds and distinguish between different sounds over great distances. He can hear heartbeats, identify voices, and perceive his surroundings in detail through sound alone. Enhanced sense of smell. Daredevil's sense of smell is highly developed, enabling him to detect scents and odors with incredible accuracy. This ability helps him track individuals and identify specific chemicals or substances. Enhanced sense of touch. Despite losing his sight, Daredevil's sense of touch has become extremely sensitive, allowing him to perceive texture, temperature, and vibrations with remarkable clarity. This tactile sense gives him a heightened awareness of his environment and enhances his combat skills. Enhanced sense of taste While not as frequently utilized as his other senses, Daredevil's sense of taste is also heightened, enabling him to detect subtle flavors and identify different substances through taste alone. Radar Sense Daredevil possesses a form of radar sense that allows him to perceive his surroundings by emitting low-level energy waves from his body. These waves bounce off objects and return to him, providing him with a detailed mental image of his environment, similar to echolocation. Combined, these enhanced senses give Daredevil a unique and formidable advantage in combat, allowing him to navigate the world with precision and agility despite his blindness. He has honed his skills over years of training to become a skilled martial artist, acrobat, and cry fighter. Number 7. Daredevil and the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles both have origins rooted in the same incident, a truck carrying radioactive material striking a blind man who was attempting to save a young boy from being hit. In Daredevil's case, Matt Murdock was the young boy who was saved, but the accident left him blind while enhancing his remaining senses to superhuman levels. He later adopts the identity of Daredevil and fights crime in Hell's Kitchen, New York City. In the case of the T-Mint e, the truck carrying the radioactive material caused a canister of mutagen to fall into a sewer where four baby turtles and a rat were exposed to it. The mutagen caused them to mutate into humanoid forms with increased intelligence and the ability to speak. Splinter, the mutated rat, trained the turtles in ninjutsu, and they became the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, fighting crime in New York City. Number 6. Daredevil has been a member of several teams throughout Marvel Comics history. Some of the notable teams he has been associated with include The Defenders. Daredevil has been a member of various iterations of The Defenders, a team of Marvel superheroes who band together to tackle threats that are too big for any one hero to handle alone. He has fought alongside characters like Doctor Strange, Hulk, and Silver Surfer as part of this team. The New Avengers. 
Daredevil joined the new Avengers during their formation, led by Captain America, following the events of Avengers Disassembled and House of M. He fought alongside other heroes such as Spider-Man, Wolverine, and Luke Cage as part of this team. The Marvel Knights, while not a traditional superhero team, Daredevil has been associated with the Marvel Knights, a group of street-level heroes who deal with gritty urban crime in the Marvel Universe. Other members of the Marvel Knights include characters like Punisher, Luke Cage, and Jessica Jones. Number 5. In the early days of Marvel Comics, the Comics Code Authority, CCA, had strict guidelines regarding depictions of romantic relationships and certain types of content in comic books. When Daredevil was first introduced, the CCA prohibited the portrayal of interracial relationships, which led to restrictions on the romantic involvement between Daredevil and Black Widow. This was a reflection of the prevailing societal attitudes of the time, and it wasn't until later that comics began to challenge and move beyond such restrictions. Number 4. Daredevil's Billy Club is one of his signature weapons and tools. It's a multi-purpose device that serves various functions, including as a grappling hook, a swinging tool for traversing rooftops, and a weapon for close quarters combat. The Billy Club can be split into two sections, which Daredevil can use as batons in combat, and it can also be combined to form a staff-like weapon. Additionally, the Billy Club contains a retractable cable that Daredevil can use for a variety of purposes such as swinging from buildings or ensnaring opponents. He also uses it as his walking cane when he is not in costume. Overall, it's a versatile and essential tool for Daredevil in his crime-fighting endeavors. I hope you're enjoying this video. Before we get to the top 3, please could you take a moment to like and subscribe to my channel as it would be a great help. Number 3 Daredevil's comic series has faced cancellation threats at various points in its publication history. Despite critical acclaim, the series has struggled with low sales at times, leading to concerns about its viability. Frank Miller's run on Daredevil in the late 1970s and early 1980s is often credited with revitalizing the character and the series. Miller introduced darker, more mature storytelling elements, complex character development, and a gritty, noir inspired tone that resonated with readers. His contributions are widely regarded as pivotal in shaping Daredevil into the character we know today. Number 2. The Daredevil character that we know from Marvel Comics was not the first to bear that name. Before Marvel's Daredevil, there was a character named Daredevil published by Lev Gleason Publications in the 1940s. This earlier Daredevil was a different character, a costumed cry fighter who appeared in his own comic series during the golden age of comics. He was a character created by writer-artist Jack Binder and published by Lev Gleason Publications. This Daredevil debuted in Silver Street Comics issue 6 in 1940. He was a costumed cry fighter with no superpowers, similar to other pulp heroes of the time like the Green Hornet or the Shadow. While this character predates Marvel's Daredevil, they are not connected in terms of continuity or storyline. Number 1. Daredevil has faced a wide range of villains throughout his comic book history. Some of the most notable ones include The Hand, a ninja clan with mystical abilities and a desire for power and control. Typhoid Mary, a complex character with multiple personalities, each with its own set of powers and abilities. The Owl, a crime boss with a unique appearance resembling an owl and enhanced strength. The Punisher, while often an anti-hero rather than a villain, the Punisher's methods and goals sometimes put him in conflict with Daredevil. The Gladiator, a former wrestler turned armored villain with a variety of deadly weapons. Elektra, while she has been both an ally and a foe to Daredevil, Elektra is a highly skilled assassin with a complicated past. Bullseye, a deadly assassin known for his perfect aim with any object he throws. Wilson Fisk, also known as the Kingpin, a powerful crime lord who controls much of the criminal activity in New York City. These are just a few examples, as Daredevil has encountered many other adversaries over the years, each with their own motivations and abilities. Thanks for watching. I hope you learned something from the video and we'll see you on the next one.